Now, the city of Tucson will soon allow food truck courts within city limits. Today, the city's planning and development services held the first meeting to get public feedback. KG9's Reina Preciado spoke with the owners of the pit, the food truck court that's been pushing for the code amendment since last year. I'm here at the pit, which is a food truck park. That's basically the main reason why this code amendment is happening. The owners have been working with the city to allow something like this to exist. And because of support from the community, it's finally happening. The pit is a hot spot for the community on the days it's open. From Wednesday through Sunday, business is in full swing with a wide range of food options. Where the pit is located, we have food trucks that, that really represent each individual that lives locally here. But the owner of the pit, Amber Donahue, says she's had to jump through hoops to keep her business open. Code enforcement got involved in June of last year because they said the establishment did not follow city code. But Donahue says there was no city code specifically addressing food truck courts. In January 2023, the city asked the pit to close, but the two organizations reached an agreement to keep the pit open because they were working so closely on this amendment to city code. It's come full circle in the last year from, you know, having code enforcement come down and say, no, you can't do anything like this, to having our city council back us. The proposal comes with some restrictions for the courts, like prohibiting outdoor generators, limiting hours of operation, and banning outdoor activities with loudspeakers or music near residential areas. Overall, Donahue was pleased with the amendment. We're very happy with the language that they put forward. The city is moving into the next step of finalizing the code amendment, followed by a planning commission study session in September. The Planning Commission hopes to have a review and public hearing in mid-October and have a refined plan to the mayor and council by December. Near 22nd Street in Pantano, Reina Preciado, Kega 9.